This video is sponsored by PellucidFX.com. Hi, this is Saev Morton with the daily update on EuroFX. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the ForexPisami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit ForexPisami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Okay, now let's take a look at the gold market. Well, gold market still also is calling in some tight range. Yes, you can see this was really small price action. Today it looks like the inside trading session by far. So uh, all in all it looks like the small uh, consolidation, something of that sort that has been formed previously. It's like the bullish flag pattern. And in general this is uh, this stands in agreement with our thought that market still could show at minimum small spike up because uh, first of all it hasn't quite uh, tested the monthly pivot point just for one buck so that high was approximately one buck lower than monthly pivot point and second that is our minor target based on the weekly pattern and market should at minimum take out of these highs but I can't exclude that this really could lead us to even further action because uh, simultaneously with the stop grabber pattern that we have now on the weekly time frame it looks like the bullish engulfing and we know that bullish engulfing pattern has the target that equals to the length of the bars so if you count this length of the bars to the upside you will get approximately the 1370 area somewhere in this area but again that is a preferable target but minimum target is approximately slightly higher than these highs something around 1355 so uh, previous analysis that we have made yesterday uh, suggests that we should uh, wait for minor bounce on the 4 hour time frame chart on the hourly time frame for taking the long position and currently uh, this now stands in progress so if we will take a look at the 4 hour time frame chart we'll see that market shows first move now shows the retracement and looks like that it's starting to move down again in fact guys uh, here could be three different uh, could be a form of three different patterns the first pattern is this ABCD pattern as we have drawn it and if this will be really the case you'll see the market will reach precisely the area that we have specified as the preferable area for taking the long position that's previous you can see highs market likes to retest this is one of the habits of the gold market to retest broken consolidations second that is the 618 support of the most recent swing that is acceptable for us um, because gold market also has the habit to show the 618 retracements and that level is acceptable as we said previously uh, due to the uh, cons uh, in terms of the depth because uh, here market in fact hasn't quite reached any significant targets that's just the weekly period resistance one uh, so that is not some significant ABCD extension on the daily time frame that's not uh, some significant confidence resistance or something of that sort not that ever bought so that's why we in fact do not want to see the too deep extension too deep retracement to the downside this will be not just not quite logical for uh, market to show too deep retracement in the current situation prior the hitting of the significant targets that's why we should be ready for minor retracement and possible upward continuation but guys that is not the single way that market could continue move here because uh, we know that market gravitates to the 1355 at minimum and uh, besides of this ABCD market could form two different patterns first one is three drive sell 1618 three drive so you can see from that high to this low market has hit 1618 if it will accomplish this ABCD pattern down uh, then 1618 extension of that possible swing will point precisely at the 1355 but also and that could lead to the free drive sell so 1618 free drive uh, and third pattern that market could form here as you probably already have guessed this could be the butterfly sell so uh, because if we will take only this extension by this action you see sorry um, that 1618 extension stands at 1355.45 if 
and if market will form here the butterfly, not the EBC passion down, it approximately will have the same target. That's why we have no guarantees that market really will show ABCD. It could show just uh, small retracement from that swing and start moving to the butterfly. That's also possible. Currently, unfortunately, I can't clarify this um, definitely. It's very difficult to predict this moment. Well, but anyway, any patron, either free drive, butterfly, or say if even if even market will accomplish this ABCD down, uh, will have the same target. So uh, in such circumstances, we probably could uh, think about the scale in. So taking the small positions uh, here and add most part of it here, with the hope that market will continue move to the upside. Well, so the, here we could get could have absolutely different uh, ways to act depending on your uh, trading style on your risk management and so on. That's a bit personal question. But uh, I mostly will be looking for still ABCD retracement, mostly based on the habits of the gold market. Well, this for me more acceptable than any other way. So, but you could choose something that you like more in the gold market. Well, so that's all that I could say about the gold market currently because you can see the price action is not rather uh, fast. It's very gradual action and that's good and because we would like to see gradual action when we are waiting for the end of the retracement. We do not want to see fast moves with the retracement. So let's see um, how market will deal with this uh, finally with this retracement whether it will be butterfly or market still accomplish this ABCD patch on, or something of that sort and whether market will continue to move high to the target that hasn't been hit yet. 